This one's called Planning, Planning Obsolescence. When Arthur was a child, his father never got him anything. He plainly and firmly told him, these things are built to break, so you buy the new model in a year. They're obsolete as soon as they get to your house. Don't fall for it. And since his dad's lessons were given sparingly, he took this message to heart. Arthur watched from NES to Xbox, from Macintosh to MacBook Pro, from 14.4K to DSL, from sunglasses to Google Glass, from skateboard to hoverboard, from buying shit at Walmart to making your own Doritos with a 3D printer. <laughs> no matter how cool the innovation, he remained steadfast in his beliefs. He was never going to be a sucker. He would make his father proud. Arthur's sister, Maisie, spoke tearfully at his funeral. His final will and testament specified a traditional earth burial in a dirt graveyard as opposed to the now common practice of vaporization into space dust and subsequent transport and en route distribution by Virgin Space Line's flights to Mars. I respected his commitment to his principles, but I just wish he would have gotten the force fields we all got after the alien invasion destroyed our atmosphere. <laughs> Seeing his head turn green and explode was something that will haunt me forever. 